Joe Gorman, 23. I'm a centre back. My goal is to play for Ireland in the next World Cup. I think I can do that. I'm good enough to do it. <laughs> when I was uh, 15, started my uh, YTS and it was from 16, 17, 18, um, done very well there, really kind of learned kind of the, everything about football, ins and outs of it, the fine detail about it, uh, captain the youth team in the, in the 21s, got to the youth cup fourth round, played in some nice stadiums and um, really enjoyed it there. Um, then I went up to Inverness, had a few options at the time, I had to go to Sheffield United, Sheffield Wednesday, um, but I decided to go to Inverness to kind of learn a different way of playing under Terry Butcher, um, which was a very good experience since he's probably one of England's best ever centre halves. He's a tough man, tough centre back. I thought it would be a good uh, opportunity to learn from probably a different kind of approach to a crew, uh, which I did learn a lot of. Then I went home for a bit to play first team football. I played a bit nine games for Bray Wonders because it's a summer season over there. Um, so I played nine games, played really well. Then I got a chance to sign for a team called Drogheda. It was very good, um, part time team. So I, I kind of wanted to keep myself full time. So I've done my bit outside of football, like in the gym, fitness work, and maybe one to one training that I got sometimes off my dad even. Um, so played 36 games there and really enjoyed it. It was a good, uh, good experience playing there. Played left back and some centre back. It was just getting used to men's football. And then uh, I got a chance to come back over to Scotland to Airdrie. Uh, I signed a two-year contract there, full time. Facilities were great, stadium was great. Um, highlight of that would have been probably getting to the playoffs. Unfortunately, we lost out on penalties. Um, played every game there, scoring two goals. So um, yeah, it was really good. Inside, and back to Gorman. Ball to meet Conroy's run. He's got space on his left hand side. The cross comes in. Andy Ryan beats Graham in the air. Here's their one nil hit. Um, I'd like to build out from the back. That's the type of player I am. I've always been since I'm 16. I've got uh, thought that way. So building out from the back playing through the thirds and um, winning headers and being very commanding and I've recently scored some goals. What would you say that you made the first time with the... My diagonal balls maybe, my heading, my passing, maybe my speed and my reading of the game. <laughs> vocal and position wise I need to improve a bit. That will come as I get older. The more experience I have the better I become. Massive fan of Barcelona, massive fan of Guardiola, and from watching them is a dream of mine to go to Spain and learn from that side. I think I'll become a better player if I go to Spain. Coached. See, the difference between English coaches and Spanish coaches is they always look for more development, for you to become better. They kind of are more of a teacher instead of England. The coaches there, just kind of a manager, you know. They're just there. For the whole of the team with the coaches in Spain I think that they take you aside tell you what you're doing wrong and make you develop more so since you've been here what have you learned from Christian to be brave 
be brave more on the ball, trust your teammates and don't be afraid to do things yourself. I venture forward with the ball, passing, longer passing and it's just gave me more self-belief really, my confidence has grown.